Now, mm -hmm. Jesus never said you were worthy or unworthy. Mm -hmm. John did. John did. So you, you get confused about the testimony of a man versus the testimony of Jesus Christ. Right. And see, Christ showed his disciples how he was in the Old Testament. And then later on, they wrote the new more for the Gentiles, right? But even then, right, right, you have to explain certain things, right? Um, and if you don't want to hear it, right, you can deny it, right? So, that's why they went to the Gentiles anyway. Mm -hmm. The Hebrew people didn't want to hear it. All. Mm -hmm. Especially if Christ was male and female, right? In form, right? By the time of Jesus, they too were acting like God was male only, right? And that's because the Orthodox are walking by the appearance of the scriptures. Yes, you can call God a who, but God can also be a he. Why? It's the source of all, right? Unlike you, right, it made us all. Mm -hmm. And when I say it, unlike you, you don't believe you were made even, right? You're a creature like the platypus. <laughs> and just as God made the platypus, it made you. Mm -hmm. But the difference is, mm -hmm. in making you, mm -hmm, you let Satan corrupt you with the knowledge of good and evil. Mm-hmm. And Satan is playing all men and trying to tell you you're the image of God, right? See, that's what the Orthodox are seeing, right? The male form is not the sole image of God, right? And then, mysteriously, the female came out of nowhere as well. You both came from something, right? A combined image. 50-50 male externally and 50-50 female externally, right? But the thing is, God is not even that image alone, right? <laughs> now, mm -hmm. if you're the maker mm -hmm, of everything that exists, right? You made it all, right? They're your creation, right? Even if that creation cannot see you, mm -hmm. Now, you know there are gases in the air. Mm -hmm. Well, you also know now your heart and light in your brain lights up. But no. Uh, you didn't always know this either, scientists, right? But Jesus talks about the light within you, whether it's darkness or light, right? Mm -hmm. Well, that's the whole point of everything, right? <laughs> Since we learn the knowledge of good and evil, they say we're not even using our full brain capacity barely 10%, right? Anyway, I know. Yeah, I yeah. am. And the thing is, though, so, mm -hmm, the knowledge of good and evil is what does that. Mm -hmm. Cause nothing that is created, right, mm -hmm. is greater than that which created it, even if you can't see it, right, mm -hmm. with your naked eye. Mm -hmm. Now, the whole universe, though, appeared in a second of time, right? Even in the Big Bang Theory, right, <laughs> The matter, in your opinion, was hurled through the universe, right? Now, mm -hmm. 
you have a Big Bang experience as well. Mm Mm-hmm. When a husband and wife have sex. Mm Mm-hmm. Together, right. And have an orgasm, right. (laughs) Now, the problem is, though, men always want to drive, right. And not let the woman drive, right. So, like I said, if the Comcast girl consented, right, as an added bonus, she would be on top, right, and there's a reason for that, right, mm-hmm, and again, right, I could kiss her into the bedroom, right, <laughs> right, right, mm-hmm, and things like that, right, mm-hmm. But at the same time, right, mm -hmm, it's her choice once I ask her if she would let me kiss her or not, which would be up to her, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Now, if we go through all the motions and she has the sex with me, right, why don't I remember that too, right? (laughs) So the reason would be she changed her mind after the sex, right? See, if we're just talking about sex, there's no reason to black somebody out, honey. <laughs> either way, either way. <laughs> but if we have sex, right? <laughs> and then you change your mind a second later, right? I don't know. We done did the sex, right? If you hit me over the head, that's assault and battery at least, right? I don't know. And sometimes they'll plea bargain you down, but still, still. <laughs> now, if you hadn't have done that, though, like I said, right? Mm-hmm. I would have had full memory. Mm-hmm. That's why I say the girl in the nail salon did something as well to black me out. Right. Over an hour in the store. Mm-hmm. But not because I meant her mm -hmm, working in her father's store that I would get her in trouble for it, right? Because she's supposed to wait until she's 16 to work in the store, right? And again, right? People were telling her she's too young. She needs to wait another year, maybe, right? And she's trying to prove herself. Well, like I said, right. (laughs) I came in not knowing what was going on. Right. But how would she know about me? Right. (laughs) Right. Unless someone's cluing her in or making it about her. Mm Mm-hmm. And making her think that if I was to come in there, something could happen, right? Mm-hmm. Between me and her, nothing should have happened, right? But the nail job, right? Mm-hmm. Didn't have a problem with any other salon, right? <laughs> Before her, mm-hmm. So, what happened with her, real? Someone hyped it up in her mind, right? To where she had sex with me in the bathroom, even, right? Because mm-hmm. I was talking about Mary Bell and having sex with her in the bathroom before again, right? I even went to the store, right? See, we have a past, present, and future, right? But you're lying if you think the Bible doesn't talk about sex, right? Now, the disciples didn't go any further because I guess they figured it was handled in the Old Testament, silly. <laughs> Right, right. Now, mm -hmm. they also thought that Mary and the Song of Solomon and the perfumes mentioned in Buzz would be enough to clue you in that her and Jesus had a lover's type relationship or were even married, right? He might have even divorced her but took her back, right? Mm -hmm. See, uh, 
even if she was with seven men, <laughs> as the Sadducees suggested, right, and asking if seven men were to have one woman to wife, who in the resurrection would be her husband? <laughs> Fall seven had her, right? <laughs> Which is an odd question to ask out the blue. I mean, why seven men? Why seven men? The Bible don't say nothing about seven men being with one woman, but it does say seven women shall take hold of one man, right? Kind of the opposite of that, even though. Mm -hmm. But if you are in an arranged marriage, right, you're to fulfill at least the first week with your wife, right? And this is usually after she's purified, right, too, too. Which is usually four, 12 to 14 days after her period, right? Uh, and if you time it right, she can even be ovulating then, right? Now, if it is Mary who is his wife, right? I don't know. That would also explain how he knew Martha and Lazarus anyway, anyway. And they were from Bethany, right? They, too, would have to go to Canaan to get married. Whatever tradition that was about, right? I don't know. Right? Right? I don't know. You don't know. I don't know all the details, right? Simply put, like John said, we didn't write it all out for you. <laughs> that means there are things about Jesus you might not could even guess at, you <laughs> know. And still be wrong. <laughs> and still be wrong, right? About him, right? Mm -hmm. But if you go by scripture, it's not just telling you Jesus was a man, right? Mm -hmm. It goes beyond that, right? It also says the man is not without the woman or the woman without the man in the Lord and the male and female are one in Christ Jesus and both are one in his body, right? Now, mm -hmm. a mediator mediates between two anyway and has to be at least both somehow 50-50, right? Or you can't fully mediate between the two, right? Now, how does he mediate between the Jew and the Gentile male, though, right? One circumcised, one's uncircumcised, right? Well, you ever heard of female circumcision? That usually happens when a woman has a larger than average clit. <laughs> or a penis, even, right? Now, mm -hmm. if a woman can have a penis on top, right? <laughs> and a vagina underneath, mm -hmm. <laughs> and she has boobs right, on her breast, <laughs> chest area, mm hmm what happens as she develops? Well, the woman encircles the man. She surrounds him, right? Same thing when the penis goes into it, right? The vagina, right? The vagina encircles the penis in a wall, right? Her sugar walls, as she needs to say, right? <laughs> right. And the woman also responds sexually to the male. Mm -hmm. Now, the male does have something, right, that travels through his body as well. Mm -hmm. Called a turd, though. <laughs> That's why my poop shoot is an exit only, right? Not an entrance and an exit. <laughs> Some of you want to use it as an exit and an entrance, right? But it's not. It's neither. Right? You can go into it, but you can't come out of it. <laughs> Only one hole, <laughs> and that's on, one on the woman. Right? You can go in and out and find pasture. <laughs> All right, when you're born <laughs> from your mother and father, right, <laughs> who conceive you in the body of the female. And nine months later comes the child, male or female, male or female. And the father, crazy kings in England, <laughs> determines the sex, not the mother. <laughs> Quit Henry VIII in it. 
with your ears, right? <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, Doja Cat won on the words last night. The billboards, right? <laughs> there she is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Congratulations. I like their, you know, pasties. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's a European look. That's a European look. <laughs> In Europe, they don't have such a hang up on nudity anymore, right? But would you know, old vain man, the spirit without the body, right? The body dies, right? What do you think your suit is here? Mm -hmm. Your body for the spirit? Mm -hmm. right. It clothes the spirit in the form. In the form. Mm -hmm. We invented clothing because of the sin. <laughs> and it has to be something sexual if you're ashamed of it, right? Because whoever heard of a male or female sticking a banana up their crotch or butt right <laughs> right, right. <laughs> no one no one but if you're gonna use a fruit for sex right the banana would be the best one wouldn't it right <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> or you're lying about something right? you're hiding something right <laughs> I'm going to eat the banana and I like to say I'm the best banana in the world today. <laughs> exactly. Mm-hmm.